Yeah, thank you. Well, we're top of the shard at the moment, but one of these two gentlemen will be top of the domestic super middleweight tree come Saturday night as uh, the champion actually defends his belt against the local hero and the challenger, Callum Simpson. So we will go to the champion first because it feels like the right thing to do. A um, little bit different, start to fight week, uh, a media lunch and a chance for you just to cast your eyes over Callum Simpson. Uh, how confident are you as you stand here now that, yes, you have to go to enemy territory, yes, you'll be public enemy number one, but uh, those Barnsley fans will be applauding you on your way out as you return home with your belts? Yes, I believe so. I mean, it's a beautiful day, beautiful here in London, my home city, my hometown suited and booted as usual and you know beautiful view so I'm actually uh, quite grateful for Boxer for putting this on. Is it a little bit of an early fight week win? Uh, you sat there and enjoyed all three courses of the media lunch that was laid on. Don't think Callum's going to be too happy but he's going to eat when he gets home I think. He'll eat when he gets home but me I'll make weight perfectly comfortably um, train hard and diligent so I can eat what I want. Let's bring in Callum I, th I think you know famous last words of a fool but I think we can trust you two to stand shoulder to shoulder big opportunity for you but it is also a big step up in terms of quality of what you've been used to is this the right step or is this a step too far I'm sure Zach will say I want to find out mate you know I've been asking uh, for this fight for, for a while you know I put myself into a position that to make myself manage for the British the British title fight and you know I've asked to get it at Barnsley and a um, boxer and Sky shows how much they believe in me and obviously it looks like they, they believe I'm going to win to put the to make a take, take a big risk and put the show on it you know my football stadium so yeah I'm looking forward to it and I, I believe that I'm the one, that I'm going to be the next standout, so, uh, stand, standout fight in the Super Middleweight division in, in, in Great Britain and only want me to prove it and I'll be proving it on Saturday night. It's limited capacity, but it was an instant sellout. Uh, what benefit will those fans have to you and uh, how do you think that Zach will react to, no doubt, uh, some hometown booze for him? Yeah, I think it's sold out straight away, but I think Zach's got quite a lot of uh, spare tickets still that he's not managed to sell. Um, he's only sold about three. So, yeah, if anyone wants tickets, message Jack. He's got plenty left. Um, the, the, fan, the fans, obviously, great to have the fans there, great, great support there, but it's only me and Shelley in the ring at the end of the day. They can't, they can't get in there and fight for me. Um, but, yeah, it's just going to be a special night all round. Great atmosphere. It's a media lunch. Has he bitten off more than he can chew? Excuse the pun, Zach. Of course. Um, he's going to find out on Saturday night. And so will all his 7,000 Barnsley fans. And I will have a, a few people there. You'll be surprised to see how many there are. How do you think you'll be received up there? They're going to love me after the fight. Just as Rocky raised his hand when he beat that Russian, um, it'll be the same here. What sort of fight are you expecting from him? And um, we know that he sat ringside when you beat Jack Cullen, and I think, in Callum's words, was he, he wasn't too worried he would have beaten both of you on the same night. Um, do you think that people were looking past you, perhaps, in the promotional sense, and, and Callum as well? Most definitely. He's in for a surprise. Um, he hasn't never faced anyone like me, and I'm in there for a night of pain. When you bring your night of pain, Callum. Is there any truth in that? <laughs> we'll find out, we'll find out. Slightly might be pain for him, but you know, obviously like I say it's a step up for me and um, I think that Zach's found his level now. Um, I don't think I was only one that were very underwhelmed by that Cullen fight. Um, but you know, he's a solid British, British, uh, well, he's, a, he's a British champion, you know, you can't take, can't enough, can't take anything away from him. And um, you know, I've got, got to give him the respect for that. But you know, like I, want to, I need to prove myself and this is what I want to do. So, you know, I've been asking for the fight. I've finally got the fight now and it's down to me to, down to, me to deliver. Right, chance for both of you to make your early fight week final predictions. Zach, and still, those belts are staying with you? Inshallah, and still, and I will knock you out, Callum Simpson. Callum, your response to that, your prediction? <laughs> I'm, the, I'm, the, I'm the new, I'm the new. OK, well, I'll invite you to do a head-to-head. Uh, -head. Let's just uh, keep the fireworks under wraps until Saturday night. Live on Sky Sports, Zach Chelly from Fulham, the champion, British and Commonwealth belts on the line, the challenger, Callum Simpson, his first title shot, the hometown hero from Barnsley. You don't want to miss this one, stacked undercard as well, live on Sky Sports on Saturday night. Well, that was tense, wasn't it? Still staring. Thank you very much, Andy.